What's up guys, today I'm gonna be reviewing the Pad Tech Fly flexible tripod. And also make sure to stay to the end because there might be a surprise. And also, I had a lot of coffee today. What's going on everybody? Brody here with Pack Review on this channel. I do a lot of tech reviews, giveaways, and also some tips and tricks. So if you are into that, definitely hit that subscribe button. Also that notification bell right next to it so that you're the first to know when I upload a new video. Also make sure to check down below. I'll post a lot more information about the product I'll be talking about today. And also I have a couple of giveaways that I'm doing right now on a couple of different videos. If you want to be part of that uh, giveaway, down below will be the links to those videos if you want to enter into those giveaways. One's a headphone, a really nice uh, pair of headphones that go over your ear. And the other one is a lazy phone holder that you can like shape in different ways that can hold your phone and you know different, you can use it in different scenarios. So if you want to be part of that, check down below in the description. So guys, definitely stay to the end of this video. So I definitely want you guys to sit back, relax, enjoy this video. Because towards the end of this video, I might be doing another giveaway. So stay to the end to find out more. So vlogging has become popular and popular every day on YouTube. There's a lot of people that do it. And we know a lot of famous people that do it that have actually made it big. Uh, for example, Casey Neistat, uh, Peter McKinney, Sean Doors, Sarah Dietschy that rhymes with Peachy. They all, you know, they, they've been doing it for years and, it, and people have grabbed onto it, they've liked it, they enjoyed it, but they all have, a lot of these vloggers have a lot of things in common when they vlog. It's, well, they have some type of flexible tripod that they use to uh, vlog, which is nice because you can typically, with, with these flexible tripods, well, you can flex it around, you can wrap it around anything, a rock, a pole, a bench, whatever it is, you can pretty much wrap around anything to get that shot that you need if it's for pictures or for your video recording. So with this flexible tripod that you see them using, which is about yay long, they use it on their GoPros, their DSLRs, their smartphones, whatever they're trying to use to get their recordings or the pictures or their content in general, they're using, typically the ones I see that is most popular for the flexible tripod is the Joby Gorilla tripod. Uh, it's probably basically the number one. It's been around for a while and it's became very popular. And what's so great about it is the legs are very flexible that you can twist it in all different directions and wrap it around pretty much anything. So like I said, I think Joby was, you know, is the number one flexible tripod, but there is a company that I've been really liking and I've been watching. And I think they, they have been getting really close to Joby. My personal take on that is a company called Paytech Fly. Their flexible tripod is great. I love it. They sent me one. I've been using it for weeks now and I am in love with it. So you can get their tripod off Amazon for just under 25 bucks. Uh, link down below in the description. And like for example, with the Joby, if you get the high-end Joby Gorilla tripod, which is SLR Zoom, that is going for $47.90. So the Pad Tech Fly uh, tripod is half that price. So inside the box, you get the tripod itself, obviously, and then also you get the adapter towards your uh, GoPro or action camera that you use, and then also a clamp that for your cell phone if you want to use your cell phone on the tripod. With the Pad Tech Fly tripod, with the legs fully straight and folded in, like if you were just going to throw it in your bag or whatever, that the measurements from one end to the other is 12 inches in length. Uh, the Joby Gorilla uh, tripod is actually a lot longer than that. So this is a shorter than the Joby Gorilla tripod. Now at the top of the Pad Tech Fly tripod, you have your normal one quarter universal camera screw and a angle ball head so that you can move the camera in all different directions, forward, back, side to side, you know, rotate it, whatever you're trying to do, you can do it with that ball head. And then on the side or at the bottom of that ball head, you have like uh, the clamp where you can, you know, loosen it and tighten it. And let me tell you, when you tighten down this clamp, you can't move that camera at all. It holds on really well. So what's a big plus on that is then you don't have the camera ever going to start slowly leaning forward on you. So that's a plus there. So for us video creators, we have to reduce as much time as possible to get that shot that we want. Or even for, for photographers. So with the Pad Tech Fly tripod, take a look at this guys, watch. 
it takes seconds for this tripod to get set up. The legs snap into position at a 30 degree angle to get you ready and get you set up to get that shot that you need. Now with the Joby Gorilla tripod, you have to bend the, you know, the, you know, the legs in all different directions and then get it all set up. It's just time consuming. So that's another reason why I love this tripod. So the legs are made out of this and I've looked this thing up and there's just a lot of science to it and it would have to be, for me to explain it, I would have to actually do another video because there's a lot to it. But this makes the legs basically, you know, as strong as how they are where they just don't break down and it keeps its strength together, which is a plus because we don't want the legs to break down and lose its strength. And then when we try setting it up, it starts tipping over on us, etc. We Well, we don't want that. So another thing I like about this uh, tripod is that, well, I've literally bent these things all over. I've twisted around everything and these legs still have not lost its strength at all. Uh, for example, like my Joby Gorilla tripod, I've used that, you know, multiple times and I've, I've already ordered my second one because the, the legs on the Joby Gorilla pod, the tripod, it loses its strength at over in time. Those like balls around the legs, they lose its strength and then when you set it up, it starts to slowly tip over, then the camera falls over, which I already have done with this one, which sucks. So I already ordered a new one, so I got a new one coming in. With this one, I have not had that issue, so that is a plus for me. So there you guys go. There is a quick review of the Patek Fly Flexible Tripod. This is my number one tripod that I will be using every day now that when I go traveling or try and get time lapse or whatever I'm trying to do that I need some type of flexible tripod, this will be my number one tripod. The Joby tripod is a great tri you know, tripod that you can use. It'll probably be, it's still number one, uh, but if you're the type of person that doesn't want to spend $47 for their top of the line tripod and you're underneath the budget, I'm, I'm telling you guys, definitely take a look at this. Uh, you'll be blown away with it. I think you'll be very pleased with their tripod and the quality of this tripod. And because I really like this tripod, I'm actually going to be giving this one away. I'm actually gonna go purchase my own, but I wanna give this away to somebody so one of you guys can try this out. So to enter in the giveaway for this one, down below in the description will be the link and information or instructions on how to enter into this giveaway for one of these. So good luck guys to everybody and enjoy it when you get it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and also make sure to hit that subscribe button also that notification bell right next to it so that you're the first to know when I upload a new video. And also make sure to comment down below, introduce yourself and say hi. I like to get to know you guys. You guys are all awesome and I'm very grateful that you guys follow me and enjoy my videos. So thank you guys, I appreciate it. And good luck to all of you if you guys go into the giveaway. So definitely good luck. I'm gonna let this run for about like 20 days and I'm gonna announce the winner probably through Twitter and also down below in the comment section as well. So make sure to follow me on Twitter because it's a little bit easier to reach out to you guys. And like always guys, have a great day and stay awesome. See ya.